know I'm late. It's okay. <laughs> Better late than never. talking about Travis Japan's participation to AGT, well it's actually Fantasy League. They, they did an early release but when they did the early release I was just coming back from Japan and, and I had slept all day. This is why we're doing this so late. You're welcome. As mentioned this is the AGT special episode called Fantasy League. So this time around it's not really individual talents performing or auditioning for the show but it's actually the judges choosing talents to compete in between them. So the talent that wins makes the judge Win. The fact that Simon was keep, was saying all the time like, oh no, but I love Travis Japan and didn't select them in their team. But we do love an icon, a legend, the beautiful Mel B chose Travis Japan. Now, I haven't watched it, I've been avoiding social media. I just saw that they were doing Just Dance and that kind of frustrates me. Then no that this is going to be like a, like an audition survival TV show. Just Dance is not the song for that. The reason they, work, they, they decided to choose this song is because it's the debut song. I understand that. If you were coming to just do a promo gig, perfectly fine. If you were a guest performing in between contestants, perfectly fine. As a contestant, not a great choice. When you have 99% in your arsenal and decide to do Just Dance, it frustrates me. I personally think 99% was the right choice for this type of competition show. It's very powerful, it's very aggressive, it's very catchy, and it's different from what they performed into the show last time. If they just went into the show thinking, okay, this is just like, we're not going to compete, we're just going to take five minutes to promote ourselves, then that makes sense, that's perfectly fine. But So that was my rent, <laughs> even before starting the video. And go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. A little flashback of last year with still Noel carrying the entire conversation. Thank you, Noel. Are they all going to talk a little bit more now? Because last year it was right after they arrived, so Noel was the only one speaking English. But now they made so much progress. I should make a video about that as well. The members have made so much progress speaking English. I'm having flashbacks right now. I don't want to talk about you. Howard, get out! I made an entire video ranting about this, so I'm not going to address it again, but you all know what I think. Mel B! Oh, look at the acting! <laughs> this was not rehearsed at all! Oh my god, this is so organic! <laughs> I love Mel B. I just have to say, the Spice Girls are my generation. Okay, she's old, thank you. Mel B was not my favorite. My favorite was actually Mel C, but Mel B is just such an icon. I'm really happy to see her on the show and with Travis Japan because she she is a legend. Spice Girls, Travis Japan, yes, sir. Uh, it's actually complicated choreography that you do. It's not like Spice Girls just did that. <laughs> it's actually a lot. You can't compare Travis Japan to Spice Girls dancing. <laughs> moving around they weren't really dancing okay thank you Melby thank you at least you know she acknowledges I love these guys really? yeah it's my can we appreciate the really I'm gonna come into your house <laughs> and punch you in your pancreas can you stop throwing shade at my babies we have been training we have been practicing we won't show how much we yeah, okay, so this is exactly what I was saying. We want to show how much we improved by doing the song that is exactly the same as before. Oh, this is frustrating to me. I have no doubt that they are doing an incredible performance because <laughs> I trust them. It's just the song choice again. It's just like, ah, oh. I so wanted them to see something else, like to another side of TJ. I do appreciate the, ja the jacket though. Good. Okay, what is the choice here? Noel, Matsumatsu, and Umin with Mel B. Did she handpick them and say like, I want this for because mm -hmm. <laughs> I am personally offended, Mel B. <laughs> Not Noel calling out how we right off the bat. <laughs> hey bitch, we get back! Noel, call this bitch out. Call him out. I'm listening. I'm listening. Oh, oh, oh. 
safer than ever. Because of me. Get out. <laughs> it's personal at this stage, okay? Oh God. They are hilarious. Well, in your mouth, it sounds like shame. I am very protective right now. <laughs> if they're good, I'm going to take them. You should have picked them in the first place. If they're good, they are good. How dare you? I am so annoyed. The, um, the audio cut is a bit weird because <laughs> I'm so used to listening to it in an entirety. I think that we're seeing the audience a bit too much. So I'm not really seeing a lot of the performance because of the camera angle. I know at the beginning Noel was a bit far out. That's why also I don't think that is a, a good choice of song because Just Dance is very physical. They jump and then turn around and they move a lot. And it requires so much more stamina to just do the dance. And sing on top of that is very risky. I remember when they first performed the song on, um, on TV, it was a bit unstable because of that because the dance is so intense that it's difficult to keep the vocal stable and you can hear it as well here okay noel hit that note thank you noel i was worried like oh oh okay he hit the note thank you saska saska noel backflip the huge <laughs> I love the Noel Fala. Oh my god! I know, I know, girl. I know. Oh, wow, I hit myself too hard. Back flip. That's good. He gave it a, an extra uh, somersault in order to land with the timing and that was really good. I like the fact also that they're changing places with Noel when he's doing this backflip. That was a really good formation. Energy 100, costume 100. Formation, I, there was uh, some good adaptation in there. In terms of technique, I think the, the break was a little bit weak. They had the vibe, they had the audience. The visual effects are over the top, a little bit much. But I don't think that was the best technical performance that they have made so far. I love them so much. <laughs> this frustrates me. <laughs> that hoe, did you see that? Everybody stood up except Howard. When I tell you this is personal, <laughs> does he stand up at the end? Everybody stood up for them. Thank you very much. Standing ovation. Except Howie, he's not up. <sighs> now he has to be cautious because he back this backfired so hard last time he took he took them down. So now he's being very cautious. <laughs> <laughs> it was <just> fine. <laughs> just say it. You hated it. We know it. I see you. How dare you? Everybody is entitled to their opinion, and it's okay. It doesn't matter. I would love Howdy. Hi. <laughs> Melby. Queen. Queen. Queen Melby in the house. She cut him off and said, "No one cares about you." <laughs> Thank you. This is why we stand this queen. Mwah. To help them. Shut up! You didn't buzz to help them. You buzzed because you didn't like it. Stand by it. You got roasted and backfired for it. It's okay. You're entitled not to like them. Just try and stop to pretend that it's to help them. It's not. But I feel like you just did. That was cute. That was very cute. I think it's a very nice way to put it as well. You know, they didn't let the, the manager's comment prevent them from going into the show. I, I really like the way she phrased it. It's very good. Also, like, oh my god, I made this shot. Ooh. Sorry, I paused on Shizzy, yeah, it looks so beautiful. I'm just like, sorry, no one, excuse me. Excuse me, I need a screenshot of that. Hold on, hold on. Very cute. I love her, I love her. She's not having it, see? I love her, thank you, thank you. That's a great way to start. You're not the best singers in the world. 
Wow, thank you, Simon. So nice to have you here. That wasn't the best song I've ever done. That was not the best song. Again, that, that I agree because it's very similar to what they presented last year and you already said that you didn't like it. So... You say it! You go, Noel! You go! And actually, every time you come on, it makes me feel happy. This okay, so he's basically saying, I like you as people, but I don't like you as artists because I think you're garbage. <laughs> it was way better than the first audition. It was way better. <laughs> I am so not having it! <laughs> Just so she's here at the back. Sorry. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. It's just an opinion. Everybody is entitled to their own opinion. You can't win them all. No, I don't want to know what he's got to say. Thank you, Melby. Melby is me. Maybe that's why I love her so much. She is me. <laughs> it doesn't matter what I say because ultimately the audience is, has the choice. Uh, yeah. That's good. My camera just died, so I'm going to just finish on my phone. Overall, I thought it was a really entertaining performance. It was more the interaction with the judges and the fact that they're just fighting amongst them to just defend each other. That was more fun than anything else. The fact that Noel is not having it as well because now he's able to defend himself and talk back, right? I really like that. The performance itself, it was good. I'm not saying it was a bad performance, I'm just saying that it's not the best that TJ has in stock. I don't think the song was a good fit for the show and I don't think that the break was as powerful as the first audition that they made with Lock Lock Miss mixed into You May Know Hollywood. That's what frustrates me, right? So I am not surprised <laughs> by the end result or by the comments. At the end of the day, I am Tim Melby and yes, I will continue fighting Howard and Simon because how dare you? <laughs> How dare you have an opinion that is different than mine? I will not have it, okay? This is war. But like he said, very rightfully so. It doesn't matter what he thinks. <laughs> so, there we go. Enjoy! Back where?